Hey, hey, hey! Today we're going to show you how we get these elegant flat iron curls on Naomi's hair. Now this is on a few week old silk press and about a five day old flexi rod set. So her hair had already been straightened prior to this style, but as you can see, it was extremely messy and needed to be refreshed badly. When I did this silk press a few weeks back, she wanted it to be bone straight. Then I did this style and at the end of the video you'll see how she says this looks better and she actually likes it better. Okay, okay, my mom was right. Now because her hair hasn't been washed in a few weeks, it already has a lot of product on it. So I don't want to add too much product to her hair, but I do need something to smooth it down before I blow dry. Normally I use an Olaplex number no. 6 and Curlsmith bonding oil, but today I'm going to be using this Bedhead After Party Super Smoothing Cream before I detangle. It's lightweight, helps with frizz, and creates a nice gloss on the hair. And it's normally $20, but right now it's on sale at Walgreens for $13.50 and on sale on Amazon in my storefront. I've smoothed it all over her hair and now I'm going to brush through each section with my easy detangler brush and twist the hair once I'm finished detangling. Now take a small layer from each twisted section and blow dry the hair as straight as possible using a big round brush creating tension on the hair strands from the root down. I am using the high heat setting on this blow dryer and although I didn't put a heat protectant in yet, I'm going to before I flat iron, I never get so close to the hair that the hair is burning hot to the touch when I take off the blow dryer so there's really no heat damage that's going to happen from doing this. When you get to the end of the hair strand, rotate your hair around the brush and pull it off like this so that the ends curl up. Now that looks good and the rest of her hair if I did it like this would look nice just like that, however I know Naomi's hair and it just won't stay like that. After a couple days that would frizz up bad maybe even less than a couple days and this whole style would be just a waste of time so no matter how much product you put in it it's not gonna stay nice like this with just a blow dry so I am gonna pass the flat iron around it to make flat iron curls and then this style will last much longer so I'm just gonna continue to do this all over her head section by section twirling the hair around the round brush strictly so that I don't have to use the flat iron super long on each hair section These blow dry curls are looking so pretty, even Naomi is surprised at how I get the curl with just the blow dryer. <laughs> you can see in her face. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to continue the rest of her head doing these blow dry curls because poor time management on my part. We had somewhere to be and I was already running late doing this style. So I just have to make up for it with the flat iron. It just is so much better if you're able and have time to do the blow dry curls beforehand. They will last a lot longer without getting frizzy. I've sprayed her hair with the Kenra Thermal Heat Protectant Spray and I'm using my Babyliss flat iron at 400 degrees and I'm just rotating the flat iron in the direction that I want the curl to form. I thought Mariah Carey was black. She, she's half white, half black. Why does she look white? Because her hair is blonde there and straight. This one might
All right, now it's time to comb these out a bit. Now you can get as aggressive as you want in combing these out. Some people brush it all out, but I didn't make these curls super tight. So I'm just gonna separate those big logs into a couple different pieces. And then as you can see, it's nice and bouncy. So at this point, we're pretty much finished. I'm just separating the curls to my liking. Now remember, these flat iron curls are not on a fresh silk press. If they were, they'd be silkier than this and withstand the wind outside much better. When we go outside, as you can see, the wind blows through these and makes them fluffy pretty quickly. And now they're more like fair faucet curls. So what I did was take her back inside and put a little bit more smoothing cream on the curls and then sprayed a light mist of hairspray to keep that from happening again. I like this better than the straight hair. Yeah, told you. Last time you were like, no, I want it just straight, no curl. Yeah, you said no curl. Yeah, you said no curl. Beautiful, huh? These curls look glamorous like my mommy on her wedding day. So pretty. So hard to subscribe. Bye!